This used to be a 1984 Formula Ford Continental made by Reynard. About five years ago, it was purchased by the Department of Engineering Physics at UBC and given to students to be a project. And since then, it's been converted to electric power. And every year, basically, we just try and make it go faster, be better, and just see how well we can engineer the car. How long have you been on the team? I joined the team last year. And since then, we have inherited the team. So there's about five of us on the team. So it's a pretty, pretty short roster, which means we get to be very hands-on and Really, we're learning quite a lot by being a part of this team. What's the peak speed of the car? Peak speed, we have measured to be about 100 kilometers an hour. And our big goal for the coming year is to see just how high we can get that to go. And how long will it go under a full charge? Under a full charge, we were just able to do three and a half laps here, which I believe is about five, six minutes. So we're more aiming at a sprint for the car, so we're looking for speed more than long distance. And is there any intention, uh, is there a, an engineering university racing league of some sort that you're part of? We are not part of one, they do exist, but for the size of our team, it doesn't make any sense. It requires much more involved process, uh, much more rebuilding of the car. We more take the, take the car and see where we can push it within what we consider to be a success.